what's up guys this is bubba tv24 and welcome to the channel today we are in the game ninja troop tycoon in roblox and uh i oh man i didn't even realize that this was going on uh i am very far into this tycoon and i am going to be showing you guys how much i've done and hopefully finish this thing out I'm gonna open up this chest here in about five seconds. If you guys enjoy this sort of thing, please be sure to leave a like on the video. Feel free to subscribe. Be sure to leave a comment on my Twitter. It is at BubbaTV24, link in the description. Hope you guys enjoy this. We're gonna build this up. So I'm gonna start off by showing you everything that I have so far and then we're gonna continue on. So what do you do in the ninja, what is it called again? Ninja Troop Tycoon. I was gonna say Ninja Clone, I got that one wrong. Well, basically you start off by building like a little, um, sushi shop ramen shop sort of place these guys are going to make you money but everybody has the they start at level one and then you have to spend money to get them all up and of course it takes them a lot of money to level up but the the key thing of this game is really uh not in here actually maybe later um it's it's actually in these two buildings right here so we have uh, these two buildings where the clones are made and the clones you get from capsules right here um, and then there's another one over here this is the cheaper one and these are basically put into a machine you can buy a bunch of clones you can even fuse your characters together different anime characters to make them higher level and then essentially what these people do is they go out here they fight here or they go all the way to the middle and fight in the very middle where you will earn twice or maybe not twice but like 75 percent more uh stuff per second or minute or whatever you've also got a free ninja here that you can attack and kill and if you defeat him you get 100 gold and one gem but i have a bunch of gems uh you will uh, get gems later. Um, I'll show you how that goes. Uh, this game is a bit laggy for me, or it's real frame ratey. It's not laggy so much as the frames are uh, can dip pretty low. I'm gonna turn the uh, graphics down so I can get the most out of it and keep the most out of it. Although it's still not doing too great. Um, so these guys, as you can see, are all level one. They are doing some weird head bob thing. Um, this place is weird in terms of trying to do upgrades because not everything you have to do a certain amount, but you have to be certain uh, distance away for it to actually count. So as you can see, I used a lot of stuff there to get uh, more money out of them. But yeah, I still have a lot of those guys to upgrade. But I don't really want to upgrade those guys just yet because those guys uh, need to be upgraded with gems. I don't have this area yet. I am the king, so I make more now. But uh, So we can unlock the boss number two here. We'll go ahead and do that. And we can go in and fight them once we have some weapons and stuff. Um... So yeah, I've got this like little training area, uh, you know, a bunch of stuff that I can spend money on. Um, although the game has been a little bit laggy for me in the past in terms of not just frame rate, but in terms of actual lag. So we'll put up a roof, we'll put the lights up. Now we can unlock the bosses, the third floor. We'll, we'll look at all that stuff here in a moment. Um, how do we get up there? Over here, we'll spend 20k shuriken on that, 8k gems. 40k shuriken, 1k gems, there we go. Now we can go upstairs, probably do it again. These guys will give us stuff if we fight them and beat them. We'll do that later, we're not gonna do it just yet. Um, so as you can see over here, we have that. Then we have stuff back here where if we go into this building, uh, we have dudes who are, who are training. And these guys are giving me shurikens. And these guys I spend money on to upgrade and once they get to level five they'll you know make more out of it but they're pretty expensive um, so there's that and then over here you have the AFK money so if you decide to leave the game for whatever reason if because you need to uh, you'll actually collect money over time and so what you'll want to do is increase your storage by as much as possible because uh, so we can hold 60k it looks like or 80k uh, at most when we're not online I don't know how long it takes to fill up, but it is a thing. Um, over here in the back, we have more dudes who are training. These guys give money as well, but unfortunately these guys, I think, cost gems as well. And so we need to upgrade our gem production in order to do that. So let's do that. I'll show you guys where that is. And it takes shurikens to do it. In here, 
Uh, actually, I haven't really bought a whole lot in here because I didn't have enough. So you can increase like damage. It looks like we can unlock different skill sets. This is where you get new weapons and stuff like that. I don't really want to pay 80k for a new weapon just yet. I want to make sure that I have enough shurikens coming coming in before I do that. But um, if we come over here, uh, this is a building that I have not completed. Uh, these are mounts, so I think these cost a lot of money. Um, so if we come in here, we can actually uh, build a mining facility to mine gems. Now, in order to upgrade these guys, we need chakra, which are these shuriken looking things. And we'll go through and upgrade our dudes here. And once they're up, then, they, then they'll mine more. So this guy mines 0.3 gems every time. And of course, we want to upgrade our dudes here to make as much as possible. But as you can see, it's very, very expensive. And so it's going to take a very long time to do it. But we now make more gems per tick. And we could even now go and upgrade our, um, well, we could upgrade the chakra. Those guys are upgraded for money, but we want to wait for a minute. Uh, so we'll use those gems at some point to like upgrade these fellas right here, which we'll do for 120 gems. And as you can see, he's making me more and more money now so now he makes uh, six instead of four um, so we're gonna go over here and check out the wall we're gonna build over here uh, I probably will not finish this tycoon in this video but this is sort of just showing the whole thing um, it takes a very long time to play this and I've been playing for many hours so if you want a very long tycoon that is going to take a very long time to play uh, this is one of them so it looks like these guys over here can get more chakras um, I also had to leave for a little bit, so that was another reason why um, it's taken so long. But yeah, so I'm just going to upgrade this stuff. So we got a money worker, so this guy's going to make some money, uh, more money workers in here. Got a chakra worker over there doing his thing. So yeah, we've got money workers, they're going to be making some extra cash. But really, we only make uh, about 100 right now per tick. That's not a whole lot. Uh, Really, that's not that's not a whole heck of a lot. And it looks like we can... Oh, it takes gems to upgrade those. So yeah, we really got to focus on the gem production. However, if you really uh, you know want to stay on top of things, make sure you're getting your gifts. Uh, make sure you're upgrading as much as you possibly can across the board. It will still take a very long time though. And it has taken me forever to get to where I am. Even though I stepped away, I actually was able to just leave the game running. Um, I just... I had to leave for a little bit. I put on an auto clicker, which I'm very open about using on games like this. And I sat there and I punched the dummy over and over again. And I've been gone for about two hours now, two and a half hours. And this is about as far as I've gotten with that. And so that's a thing. Um, over here is uh, like uh, a, th a portal where these enemies will spawn. And I have a few anime characters here who are attacking these enemies as they come out. And of course, if they die, they come back. But once they attack these enemies, I get some money. I think I get a few gems out of it, that kind of thing. So let's do another summon here. Uh, so we can summon, okay, that guy. And then we get a free summon here uh, for the first time only. So you get one free summon at these areas. A C tier, level 8 guy. He's the basic guy. And, uh, okay. So what you're going to do with these is you're going to come here. And this guy right here is level 8, so we might, uh, let's see how he is in comparison. 50, 187, and 10. 61, 173, and 20. So he's actually uh, a little bit better. Not by much, though, really. Um, definitely better than this guy. So let's load you. Uh, well, we'll not load uh, we need to figure out where to load them, actually. Um, but if we get enough characters uh, that are just kind of throwaway, you can fuse them into other characters and level those people up. So that's something you'll want to be doing to make your character stronger. Uh, he's in... No, he's not in this one. Did I unload? Equip the best. That's what we'll do. We'll just hit equip best. It equipped four people. What are you doing? Okay, there. So we got people in here and here. Uh, we've got people... We got an empty one here. Jeez, put him in there. Equip. There we go. 
So we got him in there. Those are full. We have a reward here. We can unlock this next one's like 30. So double cold and double chakra for six minutes. Nice. That's awesome. And then did we unload over here? We did. We unloaded somebody over here. Oh, shoot. Um, let's put the level seven in there. There we go. Okay. So that's a thing. Uh, so yeah, we're just uh, upgrading stuff and buying as much stuff as possible. It does take a long time to do this, like I said. I'm having a good time, though. It's a pretty good uh, tycoon overall. But uh, yeah, be sure to just upgrade all of your things as much as possible. Oh, we have another guy here. We can even, I think, upgrade the overall clones. Um, if I go back, yeah, my frame rate is just, just tanked right now. I don't know what the heck's going on. There we go, we got some windows, we can upgrade more windows. Yeah, it's, it's a bit laggy, but it's also really frame ratey right now. So we got a whole other area that we could put clones in when we get there. We also have a second floor, it looks like. Oh yeah, look at that, roof ornament. Do we, can we go up to the second floor? No, it's just, uh, uh, just to look good. Okay, that's fine. Uh, so one of the areas, like I, I think I showed at the beginning, I think it's this building right here to the left. If we go in here, we can actually upgrade stats overall. So like, uh, we can upgrade for 25,000 chakras. We can uh, upgrade ninja speed, upgrade ninja health, and upgrade damage. And then here we can upgrade player health and more player health. So we can get two health sets of health upgrades. This is speed, health, and damage. Let's put something into damage. So they get a 5% damage increase, and then, of course, they'll get health and all the other stuff. This also costs gems and chakras now. That's a lot of stuff. So we really have to sit there and just dump everything into mining gems and stuff like that, it looks like. So this is pretty busy. It's a pretty busy, um, like, game. And it is a very busy and expansive tycoon. Like, if you just zoom out, look at all, look at how, if I can get up on, on this building here, if I can do this quickly without, ah, get up here, there we go. If I get up here, look look how big this place is. This place is huge, and almost every single building has something to upgrade in it and do. Uh, and there's even a button there I didn't know about. But yeah, so that's a thing. There's a lot to do here. It's a lot to keep up with. And if you guys, oh, I got a gold pet. Oh, what is a pet? Wait, what does it do? Upgrade it. Upgrade needs a thousand gems. So it's actually giving me more gold per second. Boom. 200 gold per second. Heck yeah. Okay, so good, good. So we actually have a pet now that gives us more money. That's good. You want to keep that. Uh, and of course money in this game is pretty much king of everything. Uh, it's gonna get your, it's your basically your, your ground level everything. So if you guys enjoyed this video and you want to see more of it, you want to see more of this game and you want to see like the ending of it, be sure to leave a like on the video. Feel free to subscribe so you know when new stuff comes out. Be sure to uh, leave a comment on my Twitter. It is at BubbaTV24. I will see you guys next time. I have been BubbaTV24 and I am signing out.